Hey guys, my name is Robin Atkast and I'm the winemaker here at Clove for Gas and I'm taking a bit of time out of harvest to introduce the September Wine Club shipment. In this month's shipment you've got some fantastic wines. Here at the winery we're pretty busy and there's already been plenty of long days and long nights. It's nice to step away from the chaos and hubbub and loud noises of the crush pad to be with you today and walk through some of these awesome wines. So first up in your September Wine Club shipment is the 2018 Sauvignon Blanc. We do get a lovely minerality to the wines. We get crisp acidity which just naturally hangs in there in the grapes. And so you get a lovely fresh finish. It's not purely fruit. There's wet slates, you get a touch of chalk in there. Just really interesting flavours that drive that depth and complexity. A really fantastic wine. The next wine is the 2018 Mitsuko's Vineyard Chardonnay. Uh, this is one of our favourite wines here at the winery. We barrel ferment all of our Chardonnays, which means that at the end, what it does is it gives you this lovely, sort of soft, creamy mouthfeel. You still have the acidity there, which which adds to the structure and keeps the wine refreshing. And it has the ability to sort of interact with the oak better. So you sort of have flavors of brioche, pizza dough, baker's spice, coconut husk coming through along with the cantaloupe, the pear naturally found in the Chardonnay grape. So I love this wine and um, I hope you guys enjoy it too. So the third wine in the lineup is the 2017 Pomade clone Pinot Noir from Mitsuko's Vineyard. In this particular clone, the, the Pomade clone was um, sourced by UC Davis from Burgundy. Ton of spice, wet clay, aged leather, but I mean, that's the, these are the flavors that we're picking up on these, which make it more of a food friendly wine. One of those wines where you know, you'd need like a roast beef or um, roast chicken, those rich hearty meals uh, just go fabulously with this particular wine. It's going to be awesome for Christmas. So the fourth wine in the shipment is the 2016 Clopagas Malbec. And this Malbec comes from our vineyard down in Mitsuko's. This particular wine is aged in 30% new French oak for about 18 months. And that all happens in, in the caves behind us here. It's medium bodied, it has Christmas spice, it has plum. And those tannins are just starting to soften up now. But that savory note runs through it, which is delicious. You know, when you sort of, when you're looking for a wine that offers something a little bit different, then the, this Malbec is it. So the fifth wine in the selection is one of my favorites. It's the 2016 Pegasso blend. This is Petit Verdot, Cabernet Sauvignon, and Syrah. It, there's nowhere else you'd find that. My wife says, you know, it, it, it's, it's like a hug in the bottle. The tannins are really approachable. It's got a lot of body and soul to it. Uh, the flavors, because of the Syrah and the Petit Verdot and the Cabernet Sauvignon, you're looking at dark, fruit flavors, so black currant, cassis, a touch of coffee bean in there. But you've also got more sort of like interesting flavors just, just beneath that, which range from your sort of cigar box to your wet earth, to the clay and the terroir of the vineyard. It's a fantastic wine, and I, I really hope you guys enjoy it. And on to the final wine, the 2015 Cabernet Sauvignon Homage from Clopa Gas. This is our flagship wine. Uh, we take a lot of pride in creating the purest expression of the terroir that we have here. So this wine is 89% Cabernet Sauvignon and 11% Petit Verdot. It spends approximately 18 months in barrel. And what we do is with the, with the homage wines, we go through and we taste individual barrels, selecting only the best. Each year is different. There is no recipe card for this wine. Again, we just want to make the best interpretation of our vineyards and deliver that to you guys. It makes me honored to think that you know, you'll be opening these bottles 
with friends, family, hopefully, you know, enjoying a great meal and uh, it makes all the hard work oh, definitely worth it. So I hope you guys enjoy the wines and you know, this is a two-way street. We make these wines and we send them out there, but we want to hear your feedback. We want to hear what you guys think. Um, and whether that's in person, you know, come to the winery and uh, taste through with us. Connect with us on social media, however you want to do it. Just let us know what, what, what you think. Even if it's something small, uh, we want to keep you guys in mind. Uh, you are the end customer and this is, this is, you are the reason why we do this. So hopefully that's given you guys a little bit of insight into the wines that we have on offer for the September Wine Club shipment. I'm going to step back, get it back into the cellar and continue the rest of the harvest. Uh, we have about another month and a half to go, so cheers. It's many long days and long nights and uh, making you guys the best possible wine. <laughs>